I'd now like to call upon Mr. Kiran Karnik, President NASCOM, to kindly please present a formal vote of thanks before we proceed for dinner. Ladies and gentlemen, good evening. This has been an evening of celebration, celebrating in some ways the success of a good year for the Indian IT industry, but more importantly, celebrating the leadership around the world that helps this industry and helps India to continue to grow, continue to boom, and take forward the revolution in information technology that's helping all of us. It's an evening when we look at the past. We saw the Mahatma there. It's an evening when we look at the future. And certainly it's an evening to enjoy ourselves. It's pleasant weather, nice skies above. And NASCOM will not take credit for the weather or the stars above, but we can certainly take credit for the stars here. So I want to use this opportunity to thank all the people who are here and most particularly congratulate our winners of the Global Leadership Awards this evening, Mr. Parmesano for his telepresence, Mr. Patrick Snowball for being here with us today. I want to also thank Mr. Donofrio for accepting the award on behalf of Mr. Parmesano, and I want to thank Dr. Sen for gracing us with his presence here and for the fact that we have had this opportunity to honor a great Indian. I want to thank the Minister, Union Cabinet Minister for Science and Technology, Ocean Development and Earth Sciences, Mr. Kapil Sibyl, who has come specially from Delhi to be with us today. It signifies certainly the commitment of the Government of India to be with us and to partner with us, as he stressed, but it's also an indication of his personal commitment to the IT industry and indeed to the many and impassioned speech that he gave about his concerns. And as he said, yes, we have miles to go, sir, many miles to go before we sleep. And the IT industry is acutely aware of that as we move forward. Thank you for being here, Mr. Sibyl. Thank you for taking the effort to join us. I want to thank each of you for being here this evening. We're just starting the fun part of the evening. The formal part is over. But before I invite you to enjoy yourselves and loosen out with a little bit of what is famous from Scotland, and I'm very grateful to Scottish Development International and Mr. Jack Perry for being here. Mr. Perry spoke about the many nice things about India. He doesn't know the magic of India where we can consume more of what they produce than what they do produce. All of you know what I mean by that. But thank you, Mr. Perry, and we're delighted that Scottish Development International is here with us. Beautiful country, as he said. You'll certainly get more people going there. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you all once again for being here. Before we close the formal part of the evening, I do just need to make one announcement for all the delegates. Tomorrow morning, we start at 8.30, a slight readjustment of our schedule. I know you'll have a great evening today, but please make the effort to be there at 8.30 in the morning. We start with a special panel discussion, which is looking really at thought leaders and looking at what has been called the strange rise of India. So 8.30 in the morning for all the delegates, please join us there, and we will take off from there on. Thank you once again, ladies and gentlemen. Enjoy yourself for the rest of the evening, the drinks, and then there's dinner. Please join us. Thank you. Thank you, sir, for sharing your thoughts. How wonderful to have so many stars, not in the sky, but right here 